I'm Sir Tap Tap, and we're gonna take a quick look here at the uh, secret ending of Yuminiki Dream Diary. And uh, <laughs> I had to trash the original recording because I got really mad for reasons. Uh, so to get the secret ending, all you, you gotta beat the game first. Then you find all the little jellyfish. There's one in each world that has an egg. And um, <laughs> I, the ending was supposed to be sweet and stuff, and you'll see why, but like, oh my god. So one of the things they added to this game was the little flute, which I guess I can't pull out on the screen. And instead of just playing the flute, being playing the flute, and you just press a button and it works, they decided to put little music puzzles in the game. And they're so minor that like any actual music fan would be like, oh, this sucks and there's no point to this. Um, but if you're not a music fan like me, they are basically torture and like hot coals put directly into your eye holes. Um, so there's like four different music note things and you gotta remember which one is which. And the colors helpfully do not at all match like the colors on any gamepad ever. Like if it was like, oh, you're playing on Xbox controller so the B button plays the, the red note. And the green note is on the A button. No, it's nothing like that. They're just the colors are random. So uh, yeah, it's great. Um, so what you do after you have done? Why does it do this? So in certain sections, just she constantly puts away the thing, the the lamp. See so what you do here? There'll be this symbol, and you got activated. It. It'll only be there after you have. Uh, after you found all the jellyfish. So now you can go into the elevator. So keep that music thing in mind, so... <laughs> of all of the... the stuff to add. So now we just continue on and we go exit to the roof. By the way, I was super confused by, like, you exiting back into your room. I thought I had just went into the wrong room when I first did that. And actually also the second one. Like, I get the symbolism, it's supposed to be her actually leaving her apartment, but in a dream. But, it's not very clear. So yeah, you, once you leave here, this will be here. You just press Y on the, you know, the fake mark of Samael. Because this game really wants to be Silent Hill. And we find, I was actually really excited when I first saw this place. And uh, we'll see why it's disappointed soon. But I was like, oh, the whole game, I was like, oh, are we going to space now? Are we going go to go to see Mars and the little keyboard dude? And then, no, nothing happened. And then, but now, we're here. So everything's good, right? Right? And there's totally not MJ, who's, you know, jamming on his gigantic keyboard, which looks even more ridiculously oversized here. So he's got a music puzzle for us, right? So, like, obviously, you're going to, you know, play his notes back in the same order. That, that he plays, right? <laughs> he just glitched out. But actually, no. If you play his notes back in the order that he plays for you, he's like, nah. He's like, no, no, you don't. We don't do this in this household. So what you actually do is you replay the second part of the song. I've gotten in some weird state where it's not doing this right. <laughs> he didn't actually glitch out like this the first time. Okay, so it's green, pink, blue. See, so yeah, he keeps doing that thing where he's like, nope. So green, pink, blue. Green, pink, blue. I bashed my head on this for like five minutes. Green. Wait. Wait, wait. Wait, no, I think I got it. Oh my gosh, I still have it wrong. I even know the solution. I'm still getting it wrong. I hate Music puzzles are the worst thing ever. If you put them in video games, I hate you. I hate your family. Wait, I'm doing it right. Wait. Wait, no, it's blue. What? Why is it? I have no earthly idea what the... I thought I had this. Don't put music puzzles in your game. Oh my god people who finds this fun. This is not fun This is I don't I don't know what I did. I I thought I knew what I did that made it work It's actually worse than I thought I I, I, I had to delete the recording because I was so mad 
and it's what? What? What is even want you to play? Okay, I think you replayed the first stanza like backwards. What is this? What is this garbage? Well, I'm not, oh, okay, I'm just brute forcing this. I'm just pressing the notes. <sighs> okay, so it's A Y X, I think. Oh my God, it's A Y X. That's not even part of the song that he plays. This is not part of the song he plays at all! It's, uh, I made this video to complain about how bad the puzzle was and that it was a totally non-intuitive thing. I was actually wrong and it's even worse than what I thought. You play completely random notes. There's no way to know which notes to play. Oh my God, I, I am so mad. I am so mad. There's that the what you play doesn't match his song at all. It's completely different. That's that's none of what he what and you have to do it twice or the door doesn't open. There's absolutely no indication of what you have to do at all. Why would they put that in there? And then your reward? Your reward for all of that? Let's let's go see. It's obviously gonna be something super awesome and cool. We're gonna go to sleep and we're gonna wake up in a whole new world and there's gonna be like four more hours of gameplay and it's gonna be great. It's gonna be finally the stupid horror remake that nobody asked for is gonna be a real game and everything's just it's all gonna be justified. It's finally gonna be worth it. Oh, it's the credits. Oh, it's just the credits. You just go to bed and you get the credits. I'm so mad. I, this is honestly worse than the part of the game where they did not know why Yumi Nikki was good. Um, I I am genuinely so angry. Wha who? <sighs> I have no words. That that is honestly worse. Like like everybody is mad that they didn't understand Yumi Nikki and they didn't. Like they made you know a weird horror game instead of you know. A second Yumi Nikki, which is all anybody ever wanted. But but that puzzle, that's not even a puzzle. That's just brute force. Let's find the notes that we want you to play or go to hell, you stupid loser. How dare you buy our game? That's what that is. Oh my god. Oh my god, people. If you ever put... I have found something worse than slide puzzles. I've always said that slide puzzles are the worst thing to put in a video game. And then if you put it in the, them in a video game, that I will find you and I will make you pay. But I have found something worse than slide puzzles. I have found something even worse than a music puzzle. That wasn't even a music puzzle. That was trial and error disguised as a music puzzle. That was me second guessing, wait, uh, did, did I get that note wrong? Oh, no, that just must be because I'm, you know, bad at music, so... But no! What I did made total sense, but the game didn't want me to make total sense. It made me... It wanted me to play random goddamn notes until it gave me a bed, and then you sleep, and then the credits roll. Like, I get the symbolism. I get the symbolism. She goes to sleep, and she, she has happy dreams with frickin' Masada Sensei forever. But I don't even care. That, that was garbage. I... <laughs> I'm so mad. Oh my god. <sighs>